Hello everybody and welcome back to Let's Play Luigi's Mansion Dark Moon. Last time we completed the the mining place, the last mansion. This time we're going to start Treacherous Mansion E1, front door key. Let's do it. Luigi, the final Dark Moon piece appears to be located here in the Treacherous Mansion. But I'm reading the highest level of paranormal activity ever recorded in the history of forever. No paranormal researcher worth, his, worth their salt would go near the place. Yep, going in there is an absolutely terrible idea. For me, you on the other hand. Well, you don't really have a choice. You're the only one who can recover the final Dark Moon piece. But don't despair, son. Look on the bright side. You, um... You, uh... You... Have a very bushy mustache. Too true. All you really need, honestly. Sorry, I'm no good at pep talks. Anywho, <laughs> this here is the front door key for the treacherous mansion. Hey, that was easy. Why do you have that? It'll make getting into this mansion a whole lot of easier, so don't go losing it. I tried to pinpoint the dark moon piece, but there's just too much paranormal inference interference in there. Inference. You'll have to look for it the old-fashioned way. Good luck, Luigi. You're gonna need it. Yeah, I'm well aware. Although this, in this episode, we don't even get to go in the mansion. Which is leading me to believe that maybe there's more than three missions. I'm, I don't know. I don't know. I think I'm getting an inkling of a remembrance that I was mad because the coolest mansion had the least amount of missions, I think. I feel that way. Anyway, look at this. There are some green streaks in that sky, and I love it. It's a big gate. I'm gonna push it. That easy. Oh wow, that's that's a hmm. That's a walkway. Jeez, there's nothing there except for the mansion. Well, you wouldn't have to worry about anyone walking on your yard. Oh, not the hat. We almost died. That could have happened. Of course, it can still happen, because I can just walk off the edge on my own will. But we're not going to do that, probably. Yeah, easy stuff. All right. Manch okay. Well, let's do that again, then. This is super safe. I love how conveniently a tiny area that's just wide enough for us to walk through is the only thing that's left conveniently and of course it's not breaking even though there's nothing holding it up at all that makes sense oh I lie I lie it doesn't it doesn't hold up at all well looks like we're stuck now there's a pixelator right there though I don't know why egad didn't use that one well, whatever this is the veranda that's the name of the street I live on not bad enter the mansion even though the key was literally like 20 times this size when we got it. That makes total sense. Oh! We did it. Hi there, don't do it. Oh, don't do it! Oh my god. Bad doggy. Bad doggy. Bid. Bid doggy. You bid. And magically, the sides open up. Uh, there's got to be money over here or something, right? We can look in at the very least. What's in here? Oh, multiple toads. Oh, there that one goes. Is he going to put him in the painting? I think he is. Oh, who is that? Who is that? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Hmm, well, we're gonna have to deal with that once we can finally get in. Ooh, what's in here? <laughs> Short attention. Oh, wow. You're skilled with a sword and a shield. Ooh, wrecked. Hi there. Yep, I'm here. Okay. Oh, oh, I just wanted to play. My hands are not very steady, I'm sorry. Alright, well, we'll just, uh, pop on down here. By the way, there's three gems that we're going to want to get in this mission, along with the boo, just in case you didn't know. Uh, you can follow the tracks of the polter pup. Um, however, the only way we're going to get down there is by going down here. Or going with this well. There's not anything I'm missing. There's money. I would luck that. I would luck that. This looks fake. That's because it is. Hey, look at that. What's behind here? 
some coins and some crows, which I can flash for mun. For mun. I don't think there's anything else really out here. Okay, I don't think so. In that case, we'll head back and go down the well in that case. Don't even think that was worth it. Not even worth. Can I, uh, grab it? Thank you. Down we go. So I remember this part of the game being extremely confusing, even though it's actually incredibly easy to get through, once you think about it for a little bit. Also, that looks like I can peel it off the wall right there. So I'm going to do it. What do you know? Money! Money out the wazoo, just what I needed. Also, mushrooms. Oh, I can actually pull the mushrooms. That's cool. Oh, bugs. You too. You too. Gotcha. Got him. Break through this wall here. Just one pull. Man, Ouija's been getting some gains. All right. So at this point, it's a maze. No, it's not the ma it's not a maze yet. It's not a maze. I, I lied. I lie. Hey, golden rat, golden rat, golden rat. He disappeared. How are we going to get through here? I don't know. Um, literally don't know. Whoa, can we interact with something here? Hello? Hello? X, X. Oh, we we're messing with his body. Okay. Can we... Like, uh... Literally don't know what I'm supposed to do. I'll suck that up. I'll look in here. What's going on in here? Hey, there's the pop. He's in that. He's down. All right. Well, we're gonna have to get there. Oh, there's a vine here. I did not see the vine at all. Well, that makes things easier. Here, I want to make them both swing at me at the same time. That's one. Oh, he picked up the th oh, That's gonna make it harder. Maybe we can lure them both into the same general area. Make him. Wait, he didn't. He's not lifting his helmet. He's... There he goes. Got him. What? I'm calling baloney. I got him this time. They're done. They're done. Oh, you're not a problem. Oh, but with your buddy, maybe you are. Here, pull me over here into safety. And you are done. And it didn't hit me. Boom. I want to grab that money. Thank you for letting me grab the money. You're done. Is that it? That is it. Okay, that was a short little uh, distraction. I took 20 damage. Oh, okay. We're going to stand over here because that's going to close once we stop sucking. Boom. Easy. Oh, also, I should probably check something so I can... Uh, I need to burn that so I can get the uh, golden bone. Because who knows? This late in the game, we may need it sometime. We're going to take this. We're going to go and set it on fire on that torch that was on the ground. We should be able to burn that as well. Nice. Th that looks a little fake. Because it is. We get a golden spider from it. Oh, the little spider web. Okay. Hey, that also looks fake. Wow. There's a lot of fake walls in here. Maybe I can find them all. Probably already missed like 50 of them. All right, let's go light the torch on fire again. Or not the torch, but the, the spider web. Now we'll light the torches. Boom, boom. Burn that spider web just for fun. Boom. That's it. We solved the puzzle. What now? Oh, hi. Hi there, you're sitting on a throne. No problem. Not spoopy at all. Okay, that's a little spoopy. Hello there, friend. We are all friends here. So, we are introduced to a new enemy. This guy is a knight that's possessed. Basically, just pull the carpet from under him and he's done. Now, the other one's gonna come alive. And just do the same thing. Lure him over here. Over the carpet. And boop! You're done. Easy as that. Honestly, not the hardest enemies in the game, to be fair. Hey, you filled my heart. What's back there in that little corner, I wonder? It is money. Hey, I'll take that. 
Thank you. Guess we won't find out what's behind there. Anyway, let's sit on the throne like the kings we are. King Luigi. That's King Luigi to you, Mario. All right, now we're in a now we're in a maze. The haunted catacombs. Er, cat, cat. Yeah, I think it's called catacombs. I think that's how you pronounce it. Um, you can just follow the the polter pups path to make your way through this. I didn't understand that the first time I played. If you go the wrong way, you end up right back at the beginning. Oh, that's that's fake. Okay, there's money back there, and I want. Not 100% sure how to get back there though. Oh, he's going that way, so we can infer, run through that so they don't block your path, that they're going, wait, what if I were to go left? Boom, secret. And it's also a secret room. Nice, oh, hopefully I can do this without messing up. It also looks like they're gonna stab and block your path. So let's uh, not get stuck in that, I see a path already. Boom, 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 boom easy not a problem our reward is 100 G's not bad I'll take it I wonder if red coins count for money I wasn't paying attention anyway now that we've done that let's actually go to the right here he goes down and into here into the underground lab what have we got going on in here some science experiments. Go ahead and zap that dude. Zap him good. If I should have zapped him even more. I would I would have gone maximum zap, you know. Just my personal opinion though, of course. It is alive. Hmm. So I'm assuming we can't flash these guys. We're going to have to uh suck the glasses. They suck me. Yep. Ooh, we got all three of them. Not bad, not bad at all. Got two of those. Let's get the triple suck with you as well. Easy as pie. Now that you've done that for the boo in this level, or in this mission, you're going to want to zap the dude yourself. Once you do that, the boo will reveal itself. Get zapped, Sonny. This is also how you get the first gem, by the way. Arf arf grr, better run from Bulldog. Man, you think the puns would get better as you go on in this in the game? They don't. <laughs> they really don't. Tiny room shouldn't be too much of a problem. 40 HP. He's gonna live. Yeah, that's okay. We got him. With our extended dark light. I wanna get triple. Boop! Suck up some more munmuns. Munmuns. That's a thing that I didn't want to say, but said anyway. And that takes care of the first boo of the mansion. Easy as that. There's also hearts in these that I'm sure you can probably get somehow. Anyway. Oh, yeah, you can get it by shooting these at it. But the first gem of the mansion, you get by shooting the helmet at that and sucking in the gem. Easy as pie. It makes one of the three gems we're going to be getting in this mission, along with the boo that we've already gotten. All right. So, interact with the knights. They'll tell you which ways you can go. Of course, alternatively, you can look for Polterpup, which to actually sends you a different path. This is for a gem. So he's gonna point us this way. Oh, hey, look, webs. Wonder what's behind that. Hi there. He's pointing us this way as well. And whether you know it or not, there is in fact a knight here. And he's gonna point us to the right, okay, so basically just take a right at every night and that's not a problem. And here we have a spider web. We're gonna grab that spider web with the fire on it. And we're going to use it to uh, light up that, we're gonna use it to get lit, basically. Anyway, use it to light up that, boom, there's your gem. Second gem of the mansion, easy as that. Now that we're done with that, we're gonna head back. Yeah, as I told you, it teleports you to the beginning if you take the wrong path. Anyway, follow Polter Paps, <laughs> Polter Paps Pap, and it just brings you right back here. Did, was there something invisible? Oh no, that was just it showing him jumping to the wall. Why does that wall look very suspicious? I don't like it. Looks like there should be a door there, but there's not. 
Hey, look, there he is. Just sniffing the random spot on the ground. All right. Makes sense to me, that's what I do. Anyway, we're gonna go ahead and, no, get a bone. Oh yeah, these ghosts here that I'm fighting literally right now is optional. But I'm going to be taking it since I do want the A rank. And I can't even get the money that he dropped. Hey, look, water. That's probably gonna be useful for something later. And a bone, okay. Of all the places to find the bone, honestly. The bone is in fact active. All right, so we can get into here. Oh, if we can find a barrel, that would be pretty dang cool. I'm not seeing one. These bars are fake. We're gonna pull this. Actually, hold on, we're gonna pull that again because I wanna see what's back here. This isn't required, but that bomb's gonna blow up that wall and we're gonna see what's back there. Anything in the barrels? No. So maybe the barrel, or the bucket's back here. Oh, hey, flower. Well, there's money, at the very least. A lot of money, wow. Uh, that's a shovel. Hi there, you do nothing. Nothing else out here, I don't think. There's not a gem, this isn't related to a gem. Okay, there's not a barrel like I wanted to see, but uh, whatever. In that case, let's flip it back over. And, uh, he's playing chess by himself. Flip it back over, go back over here, and let the bomb blow up the wall. Boom. Uh, is there really not a bucket anywhere? Because there's a puzzle there. Is there not a bucket up here? I don't know, mate. Is that, that was for the door, okay. Maybe it's invisible somewhere. I don't know, I really wanna find the, oh, I'm stupid. There's a the bucket, fill it up. We're gonna pour it on that plant, see what we get. It's not a gem. I know that much. I'm just curious. Just more money. Okay, no big deal. All right. And when we come into here, Polter Pup's going to be uh, in here. Yes, there he is. Finally, this will be our chance to catch him. If you don't catch him in this room, then he's just going to run to like one of the joining rooms and he'll hide in a random barrel. Not that hard to find, honestly. But we finally got our key back. Why? Oh, that's sideways. We can't check anything. Is, is Egad gonna call us? Oh, hey, yeah, the money. Okay, it was waiting for us to get the money. Also, there was a little lag when I picked up the last piece. Bravo, Luigi. Someone needs to put a leash on that blasted pooch. Yeah, you're pretty far from the mansion's entrance now. It would be faster for me to bring you back here and then send you back to the entrance. Hold on. Sure thing, Gad of the Ease. Honestly, I found a lot of secrets in that mission. I didn't take too much damage, so I think that's that's worth a three-star rank. I mean, it was a little slow. It was exploring, though. Yeah, that's three. No, that's two. Dude. Man, I'm doing bad at this. I'm gonna have to go back and get a lot of three-star ranks. That'll be a fun side project on my own time. And by fun, I mean probably most likely than not, more likely than not, torturous. But I'll get it done nonetheless for the triple golden EGAD coin on the menu screen. That's all I want it. That's all I want it for. Cha 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 yourself, Sonny. Welcome back, youngster. Nice work hunting down that front door key. That dog really took you for a walk, ho ho. Yep, that, that's funny. Jokes. Stick it in. Also, have we gotten the the special blue ghost yet? I'm not sure if we have. Yeah, we haven't, so that's the first time we actually caught him. And of course we got the boo. More meaningless money. Maybe we'll hit 40,000 by the time we're done with this. Probably, actually, now that I think about it. Especially since I have to go back through all those missions. Ha, got you now, you spooky mutt. I made some adjustments to the capture mechanism so we couldn't escape this time. Although you didn't encounter as many ghosts as I thought you would. However, that was just the basement of the treacherous mansion. Who knows what the rest of the place has in store for you. The mansion looks a lot creepier than the last time I saw it. I wonder who's been redecorating. 
Anywho, I'll adjust the pixelator to send you to the mansion's entrance. In the meantime, why don't you do some training in the Scarescraper? I already have. You'll need to keep your skills sharp to make it through the treacherous mansion. I'm sure I will. Um, but yeah, he'll just, uh, type for a couple of hours. We'll just, uh, leave it on here overnight. No. What's the point of that? He just, like, you press A to make him stop typing and then go to the main menu. Double trouble. Okay. Didn't know we were dealing with Team Rocket. But we're going to do that in the next episode, so join me when we go do that. And goodbye.